Vice President Kamala Harris was in Colorado today to tout the $1.9 trillion rescue plan. Harris highlighted the administration's efforts to provide enough vaccine for every adult in the country. She also put a spotlight on a very deserving local business. Denver 7 political reporter Megan Lopez has a story. One minute we have a giant blizzard and we're out shoveling snow. The next, uh, the Secret Service is outside. It was just a glimpse. Out here to see the first female vice president and just really excited. A chance. We've been reading some books so that we know a little bit about who she is. To see America's first female vice president in person and maybe get a picture. She came out and was very gracious. She uh, waved to everyone that was there. But also a chance for the vice president. Tomorrow is going to be a year where we have uh, our uh, official close uh, shutdown. To get a glimpse into how Colorado businesses are handling COVID. And I still have two that are completely closed. That doesn't make sense to still open. One year tomorrow. Vice President Kamala Harris stopped by Maria Empanada to hear from businesses that have been struggling to stay open for the past year. And that's absolutely part of the message that I gave is the necessity, the immediate necessity that we need. I mean, we don't know if we can make it for for, for some, I mean, for next month. All of this part of a nationwide tour by the Biden administration to tout the $1.9 trillion COVID relief package, including $28 billion for restaurants. Our small businesses were devastated by this pandemic. We want to make sure that you can stay open. Um, so these are the things of the American Rescue Plan that were purposely designed to bring relief so that we can get back up and running. Their bottom line is that help is here. Megan Lopez, Denver 7.